for the equipment. And then when I track this, then it's in the sales area over here and I can go into the customers. We can go into the customers and we can check out customer number five that way, or we could do it this way. We can hit the estimate, which is probably the best way to do it. Hit the estimate up top. There's customer number five. We've got an open estimate. We can populate an invoice with that. We also have on this side, if we go into the sales tab, your estimates tab here. So you can sort your estimates this way. And you've also got your all sales items where you can where you can use this to hit the drop down and sort by estimates by the way that one's located in a little bit different place on the business view so in here we've got the get paid paid area there's your customers there's your estimates but if you want to go to that sales thing it's located under the bookkeeping tab and then transactions and then the sales thing so they kind of threw that one threw you a curveball on that one so you got to wait till it curves over the plate till you can so you can hit it so there's the estimate uh on that one okay so now we're going to record the received payment that we would base on the estimate so now we're going to say if i look at the flow chart we're going to say okay we made an estimate to help us to to save the guitars and not not so we have them on hand and then so we're going to reserve the guitars and then we're going to go to the receive payment here before we make the invoice